Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and if you're new, hello. I have a new product that has actually impressed me so much. I have received as a gift this Rogue water bottle and I know that water bottles that are double walled has been a huge hit in 2018 following from Clean Canteen where it could keep your water cold for the next three days. <laughs> I, I don't have clean canteen, but I know some of my friends and my sister has it, and she swears by it. And you can also use it for hot beverages, but she says that she noticed that it's better if you keep your clean canteen one temperature at a time. So like you have a clean canteen, you have a water bottle for the hot beverages, and you have a water bottle for the cold water. I think she says the temperature is maintained better that way if you like decide which one is for you. But I don't know, I don't have that. I do have a thermos that has kept my food warm for like 6 hours and I've been very lucky to, to purchase that because now I don't need to go do microwave my food or my lunch. So I love it. So what makes this Rove water bottle different? What makes it different? is this small part right here which is actually a speaker so it's it's connected by bluetooth and you can turn it on and i'm so happy about this because this is nuts this is just like one of the most amazing inventions i've ever seen because not only is this directed towards gym fanatics but I see this more as like a travel bottle, like when you're in the beach and you're like hanging out with your friends, you have some gin concoction in here and you can drink alcohol, you can mix your gin right in here, keep it cold and you have your music right here. This is, this is nuts. This is just like one of the most amazing inventions I've ever seen. And I'm like, I'm over the moon about it. And everybody who has seen this and has tried it, they wanted, they wanted to snatch it away from me. And they say that I have to take care of this bottle. Otherwise, somebody will take it away and it could be any one of them. So let me give you the details about this Rove sound bottle. So it keeps the, the stainless steel double wall vacuum insulation keeps drinks hot, 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 hot up to 8 hours and cold up to 24 hours. I don't think everybody really claims 3 days but I think they can get you there. This speaker is waterproof and detachable and it has a charging port so this is where I charge it. So there. So it comes with a, a cable for where you can actually put this and charge it on a USB port. And it has a 2 hour battery life. The cover or the lid is leak proof and I can attest to that. I've been bringing this and it hasn't leaked at all. It is odor, taste and stain resistant. The Bluetooth version is 4.2 and the working volume is 130 Hz to 20 kilohertz and then the charging time is 1.5 hours and the distance is up to 11 yards and when it is already low power you can see this blinking in red so let me just turn it on for our audio pleasure so I'll turn this on so you can see it's it's blinking in red and blue and what I'm gonna do is I'm going to connect my Bluetooth here I have my Spotify my ever reliable Spotify I already paired this together so we're already good to go so I'm gonna click sound bottle and that tells you that it's already connected so let me just go to my Spotify. So I need to turn that down a bit because 
YouTube will give me a cop copyright strike if I post something more than 20 seconds. So anyway, this is epic, like epic, the most epic that I've ever come across, the most epic water bottle. So how do I clean it? I'm really careful about it because even if they say that this is waterproof, of course I'm not gonna like submerge this in water because it only says waterproof. So what I do, I take this off and I use a cotton bud to like really scrape off any any dirt or wax because I wear lipstick and sometimes I drink from the bottle. So I use a cotton bud to reach into the insides and sometimes I put soapy cotton buds and then I wash it off with like wet cotton buds and then when it's already like kind of like taking care of that I don't get any residue from my lipstick or whatever. I just kind of let the water flow in here in this way and then I'm sure that, of course water goes down and then I don't turn it over. I let it like drip first and when it has completely dripped like even in this part I turn it this way. So I kind of like let it stay there for a bit maybe about three hours or two hours and when it's already dripped everything in this part will no longer go to because this has holes in it where the sound comes out and I don't want any of the water getting inside I'm sure it's not a good thing and it's quite it's not so much of a pain to to clean versus the amount of like fun I get out of this so it's okay I'm willing to do the extra mile what I did recently was find this epic invention as well I found this cleaning tool from uh, Lock and Lock and this is uh, like a really thin toothbrush it's very thin so now I can actually go you know s scrape it off and I was thinking you know this is a cleaner actually for your Lock and Lock lids but I thought you know this could be very useful for my water bottle long press to turn it off and it's turned off everybody was tinkering about this bottle my colleague noticed that, that the sound is much better, more resonant if it's attached to the water bottle. So you need to attach the lid to the water bottle for better like sound experience. Did I get a lot of scrapes and whatever? Yes, I did. I had the, the unfortunate incident of putting this in my Marc Jacobs sling bag. And that one has metal like all over the, the zipper the enclosure and everything so it kind of like had a scrape there so what do I do to keep this in its pristine goodness I just use this like I have a, a cover for it every time I bring it I just cover it with with something to protect the body so that it doesn't have a lot of scratches and there's there's nothing I really can do about it because I thought it would be a bit scratch proof because it has a bit of a texture and I thought it would be free from all that but but lucky me I mean you know I used this kind of bag that has a lot of metals in it and I was that was my fault I'm sure there will be more scratches in the future but as long as I don't bump it and I don't like give a dent into it and I don't ruin this this amazing speaker I'd be, I'd be enjoying this for a long time and I'd be really happy to travel with this and I mean hit summer more with this because I'm, I'm happy and uh, I mean people were thinking of me putting water in here. Heck no! I'm gonna put like alcohol in this and I'm gonna bring it and I'm gonna slay summer away. So there you have it. I hope you, you like this water bottle as much as I did and if you already have this or you already uh, are thinking of having this, I suggest you do. So leave me a nice comment below and I'm sure to get back to you as soon as I can. Thanks a lot for watching and see you again soon. Bye!